I'm Chu Chu, and I'm so happy to see you again.、Uh, now I'm in Hangzhou, and it's a city、uh, which is in southeast part of China.、Uh, it's not far from Shanghai. Well, in Hangzhou, it's almost summer here. I love summer because in summer I can eat a lot of fruits, and I love fruits. So today I'm gonna teach you how to say some names of the fruits in Chinese. First, let's learn how to say fruit in Chinese. Okay, it's 水果水果 First one,、uh, it's very simple, and、uh, it's these. Yeah, apple. So how to say apple in Chinese? It's 苹果苹果 In Chinese, if you wanna say one apple or an apple, okay, there's no need for you to plus、uh, an or a in front of the word. But pay attention here. You need to use the quantifier. So here, an apple. You can say it 一只苹果一只苹果 But how to say if there are two apples?、Uh, in Chinese, there's、uh, no plural for the nouns. You can simply say, 两只苹果两只苹果 So have you got that? 一只苹果两只苹果 Next is this banana. Yeah, so banana. How to say it in Chinese? It's 香蕉香蕉 One banana, we can say 一根香蕉一根香蕉 Well, two bananas, we can say 两根香蕉两根香蕉 And here. The quantifier we use to describe 香蕉 is 根 Well, next one is one of my favorite fruits in、uh, in the summer. Okay, it's this peach. Okay, so how to say it in Chinese? It's 桃桃 So you can find that 桃 is only one character. So if you say something, some fruit、uh, which has only one character, you can plus z,、uh, just after 桃 so you can say 桃子桃子一只桃子一只桃子两只桃子两只桃子 The peach I show you here is、uh, I can find that it's a little hairy. So this is kind of peach、uh, that we call it 水蜜桃水蜜桃 means that、uh, they are sweet and really fresh and、uh, juicy. The、well, next one is also one of my favorite fruit. And it's really sweet. It's this. Yeah, it's lychee or lychee. I just heard two different pronunciation of this English name, but in Chinese, it's called lychee. Lychee. The quantifier we use here is k because it's smaller, smaller than an apple. So yeah, 一颗荔枝一颗荔枝两颗荔枝，两颗荔枝。Next one I'm gonna show you is something that you、uh, might have not seen before. So yeah, let's see what it is. It's like that. Yeah. Okay. So I checked the English name of this is waxberry. Waxberry. So in Chinese, it's called yang mei. Yang Mei, hmm, yeah, okay. Oh, it's a little bit sour, but yeah, sweet, juicy. I like juicy fruit here. Let me finish my Yang Mei. 
and I'm gonna introduce the next one. A little bit sour here. Next food I'm gonna introduce um, is something like tropical. So first let's say how to say tropical fruits in Chinese. So tropical we can say 热带, 热带. So tropical fruits we can call it 热带水果, 热带水果. Dun dun dun. Yeah, it's, it's mango. It's really a oh, little mango here. So how to say mango in Chinese is quite similar with the English pronunciation mango. In Chinese, we call it mang guo. Mang guo. So, yi ke mang guo. Yi ke mang guo. But if you're going to describe some larger mango, so you cannot use ke, you can say yi zhi mang guo. Yi zhi mang guo. So let's uh, go to the next fruit. And the next fruit, maybe it's not a fruit because I'm just a little bit, not a little bit, it's, it's sour. What's this? Lemon, yes. So how to say it in, in Chinese? It's ning meng. Ning meng. Okay, yi ke ning meng. Yi ke ning meng. Well, um, they are all the fruits I can find in my fridge for today's episode. Let me know which is your favorite fruit in here and uh, let me know uh, if you can understand and uh, learn how to pronounce those um, names of the fruits in Chinese. So let's see you next time. I'm Chi Chi. Goodbye.